Peace and love, strength and honor, Samir Saif representing Ontario top team, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, Muay Thai and boxing. And today I'm gonna to pick up in the third of a series for boxing of defensive movements. I'm gonna teach you three defensive movements against the orthodox jab. So we, here we are in our boxing stance, using our boxing shell, our body a little bit turned away, jab comes through and I stop block. Stop block. I 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 stop block. And just to break that down, what I do is I learn to stay in line with my temple and jaw, and I turn my body, solid structure, strong forearm, strong line up with my shoulder, and I go boom, I stop it, and then it comes right back if it's left my face at all. But most of the time, I'm pretty much, you can see I'm in behind it, I'm tucked in and my shoulder's gonna be supporting it. So on Bob, who's boom, right on the button of my chin already, when he's jabbing here, I stop, lock, boom, and you'll see I turn my body a little bit and I'm right in behind that glove. So we're moving around, stop, lock, stop, lock, stop, lock. So just remember, try not to reach out with your hand. Now, the three movements I'm showing you are like a screwdriver. So the initial part that I've taught you, which is a slight rotation of the body, and depending on your body type, uh, some of you will, will need to turn on the ball of your foot more, and some of you will be able to twist your uh, upper body. So that's a physical thing that you can work on. One is not necessarily better than the other. It's whichever one works the best for you. So here now, using that same first motion, I'm gonna parry the strike, I'm gonna parry, and what you'll notice is I can see just over my glove, and I don't pass my midline or my center line. I parry because the punch got past the palm, and thank God I was in behind that hand. I didn't reach out, so all I did was I redirected it to the far shoulder. So here I am, defensive position moving, and I parry, I parry, I parry, and I parry, and sometimes you'll see I'll parry and step. I see it like a parry and step just to get a new angle. I parry and step. And here I'm on the button bob. Same thing, he gets inside my glove, so I'm using just my wrist, and as long as that glove lines up with the far shoulder, I've gone far enough so I don't get double tapped with maybe a feint or a jab tap and then a hook, so I go parry, and there I am with that step, parry with the step, and something I'm just here, boom, and I stay in that corner, and I just parry. The uh, last movement, just uh, especially if you do stuff outside of boxing, you have to make sure placement of elbows, so if you have a picky ref, and just to be polite with other people, you will be busting up their hands and stuff, is, is lifting the elbow too high. So in boxing, what we try to do to get that cover is we try to turn our body and, and hide deep inside. So instead of lifting my elbow so much, it's, it's more like I see I look good. And I really try to tuck in behind that elbow form where I'm still able to defend my body. So that's a body thing, you know, depending on how much you can move your your shoulder, but these stay in place. Punch comes in, that jab comes in, and I just go boom, like that. Boom. And you'll see how that works. And what you'll notice is that when I cover, I learn how to put that elbow form in line with what he wants to hit without turning my body too much. And then it's back covering the body. And then if you look again, you gotta jab up a little bit. There we go. Jab's coming in, and sometimes this is just the position I'm in, and boom! And I just, same twisting motion with the cover using my, my forearm, elbow area here, mostly forearm and glove. It's just like, I look good, I look good. I cover, I cover, I cover. So now I'll put all three together and you'll see it is like a screwdriver, you're just changing the head and that's why it makes it really, really straightforward to learn. So with the stop block, I stop, 
If he gets past my glove, I parry. And if he's just all over me, I cover. You see? It's all on the same line. Makes life really, really easy. So you move it around with your COVID-19 free partner, doing your stuff, moving, and your shot clock. Parry. And cover. And those will be the three defensive movements that we would learn against the orthodox left-handed jab. Peace and love, strength and honor, Samir Seif, representing Ontario top team Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu, Muay Thai, and boxing.